Hey guys, Only Luxury here. Thank you so much for all the support I've been getting on my videos. I really appreciate that. If you guys can just hit that subscribe button, please don't forget to do that. This will notify you every time I have a new upload. Let's get right into the video. What is going on everybody? I don't know about you, but I've been playing this game way too much, and I'm talking way too much. The game has been out for about a week now, and I've been grinding. I'm already first prestige. I'm first prestige level 23, I'm pretty sure. This clip is just me hitting level 55 and prestiging. For my unlock token for the classic Call of Duty weapon, I chose to unlock the Mac Tab 45, that's like the UMP. It's a really good gun because I've seen it on other YouTubers' channels, them using it and them saying it's really good. The next gun that I'm gonna unlock with a classic unlock token is gonna be that pistol because it's supposed to be really good too, it's a full auto pistol. And in this gameplay, I get a 30 KD. So this video is going to be about how to raise your KD. So. First of all, assault rifles are the way to go if you want to get that KD just a little bit higher because this is going to force you to have a little more defensive of a playstyle and not constantly be rushing. Now with a submachine gun you can't really play that laid back that defensively because your gun is only good for a short range so you want to be rushing a little bit. But don't get me wrong, I am not saying to camp. I'm not saying don't play offensively with this gun, because what I'm doing in this gameplay is I'm rushing but not going too close to the enemy, even though assault rifles in this game, in my opinion, are a lot better than submachine guns, because I am constantly outgunning submachine gun players, because, well, first of all, this gun that I'm using, the NV uh, Fallout, it's a variant, it's a purple variant that gives me the nuke. So I already have an advantage over all of, over all other guns because it's a variant. And this specialist that I'm using, it has a vision pulse. That's what I'm using as my specialist weapon thing. And, but unlike the Black Ops 3 vision pulse, this one goes out so far, can detect enemies from so far away and it lasts a while it's pretty much a guaranteed kill I definitely recommend you guys to try it out I forget which specialist it's for though just try and find the vision pulse thing that's not what it's called but you guys should be able to find it another huge huge tip that has helped me is you gotta run a suppressor and ghost these two perks make you so stealthy you won't show up on the minimap at all unless they have a UAV and you're not moving don't camp guys, camping is almost never the right option, the, it's never the right playstyle to choose from, almost never. If you have to camp, play defensively so you push up, then you camp in a certain spot for a few kills, then you just switch camping positions as you move along the map to where the enemies are spawning, just play it tactically. Also, you guys always have to be aware of the lobby you are in. If it's a sweaty lobby, if the players are really good on the opposite team, you should have a dead silence class already made because the chances are they have headsets and it's really easy to hear footsteps in this game. And dead silence, not only does it make your footsteps quieter or it doesn't allow the enemies to hear you at all, it's a built-in blast suppressor from Black Ops 3, so you can't be heard thrusting or moving. You're completely silent, and it helps so much. It's really good for all situations. Now, pretty much for all, I'm talking every single one of my tips and tricks videos, I'm going to say that practice is the only thing that will guarantee you to improve your KD and improve at anything so without practice, none of these tips will work. You guys just need to practice doing all these things, see which ones work for you, and I promise you, you will get better at this game. Your KD will go up. Currently, I'm sitting at a 2.4 KD, a little bit above that, and it's still going up because I am using these tips, and I'm playing this game a ton. But that's all the tips I have for you guys. Please be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. 
I will see you guys next video. Goodbye.